For those of you watching, just a heads up, this is going to be a slower paced video. If you haven't noticed it already, times are getting tough and they might get a little bit tougher before they get better. And one thing that I've had the opportunity to see a couple of the last time things got tough. And one of the things I wish I had done more when things got tough was invest, not trade options. Invest. Trading options is cool, but ultimately I trade options for income and I invest for my future. And it is in these hard times, these difficult times, it is times like this when your money feels as if it is worth almost nothing, that your money is actually worth so much more than you even realize. The only thing is that money is worth a lot more now if you tuck it away than it is for you to go out and spend it on whatever thing you're going to spend it on just a quick little question for thought would you rather work 40 to 60 hour weeks for two years and never have to work another day in your life or would you rather work 30 to 40 hour weeks every week for the rest of your life until you die i'm genuinely curious the answer to your question hey be sure to let me know down below in the comments but anyways getting back to it times are getting tough and i recently opened a brokerage account with interactive brokers because there are a lot of people that reach out to me that aren't based in america and i love that they have options futures stocks and they have that stuff for people around the world so i really wanted to sign up make more grasp of the platform so i opened the account i continue to use robin hood i continue to use moomoo Moo, but ultimately i like to have certain accounts for certain purposes certain kinds of trading and this interactive brokers account is going to be one of my long-term investment portfolios i've been investing into it for about a month now all i'm doing is depositing 500 dollars a month and putting $10 each day into two different stocks. And right now those two stocks are PayPal and Tesla. Now I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This is just what I'm doing. But uh, these are two stocks I think have good returns ahead of them over the next couple of years. This isn't money I'm gonna need to take out anytime soon or anything. I really just feel like it's a really good buying opportunity for these stocks. I personally don't think PayPal is gonna go a crazy amount lower. Tesla might have some more downside, but really uh, Tesla can turn around so fast at these levels. I am loving it. Getting back on with the video, I am buying $10 of Tesla and $10 of PayPal. Every day the market is open. I want to document this journey. I want this portfolio to belong to the channel. And yeah, this is day one or maybe it's been about a month in. I think I've been doing this for like two or three weeks now. So Maybe it's not day one. This is video one of just investing every day into two stocks. Maybe over time we'll invest into three, four, but right now, yeah, just want to show you where the account is, where the portfolio is, and just over time, just track the growth of this portfolio. And that way we can see the impact that investing and consistency in small good decisions make. Now, without further ado, let's quickly hop in and take a look at my portfolio. Here we are in the interactive brokers platform. And as you can see right now, my the current value of the account is sitting at 559. Uh, you see there is $500 on hold. And what's going on there is, uh, once again, I said I'm depositing $500 into this account just to keep it funded. It's automatically investing $10 a day into Tesla and PayPal. And what we're gonna do is just take a look at where I'm sitting at on these. So right now, Tesla is trading at 146.90, which, hey, this is looking great. I'm thinking it can get better, but Tesla could also just reverse in 180 on any kind of news. I think it could potentially come down to 130, maybe 100 again. And I would love that, like absolutely love that. Um, but yeah, that's Tesla. The last day it traded, it came down 2.75%, came down $3, three cents on a day. And right now I have invested a total of $151 and 30 cents. And right now I own nine tenths of a share at an average price of 166. And not even owning a full share, I am down already 
eighteen dollars on my Tesla position. And then going on looking at PayPal, you may notice here PayPal is trading at sixty two oh eight, down seven tenths of a percent the last day it traded, which is amazing because the most other stock they were demolish like look at tesla's how much tesla's down uh, my cost base it's 214.74 uh, that's how much i've invested total into it and i do want to add that i purchased a full share of paypal before i started buying into both tesla and paypal ten dollars a day so i do have a bit of a head start on paypal i currently hold three and a third shares of PayPal. And my average price on PayPal right now is $64.85. And I'm down a total of $9.19 on PayPal. Right now, the cash I have in my account is in that 220 and got about five, and, and I have 500 on the way. So that'll put us at 720. And yeah, the plan with this portfolio and the plan with those positions is really just hold them even if they skyrocket 20x anything like that the plan is to just hold them until i die unless the fundamentals of the company just this portfolio is not anything that i need access to and one thing i also have in mind once i grow this portfolio to a certain size i can use this collateral take loans out against it maybe in the future use it for things like purchasing real estate so with that in mind there's no reason i should ever really need to take money out of this account but anyways just wanted to share this video uh just wanted to bring something new to the channel at its infancy a brand new account and share the experience with you if you enjoyed the video learn anything be sure to smash the like button if for some reason you made this far and haven't already be sure to subscribe and last but certainly not least thank you so much for watching matthew manuel signing off and i want to change your life